University. They're all amputee victims and yet they're picking up the game of softball. WUSA 9's Evan Koslov has their heartwarming story. There's no such word as can't. A simple philosophy. Uh, it feels really good. For a group of kids that are facing some barriers. I got them when I was four. Take Damian Sanchez. Like everyone else on this field, he's an amputee. But that's not stopping him from playing some ball. Just being surrounded by a bunch of amputees, so I'm not like the only one. It's all part of the kids camp, led by the Wounded Warriors amputee softball team. They travel the country to play some softball and mentor kids. You know, it, it's hard enough growing up being a kid because kids are just mean to each other in general. Saul Bosquez is one of those wounded warriors and he's got an amputated leg for himself. I was in a Humvee that was hit by a um, IED, a roadside bomb, and hit the right side of my vehicle and hit, the, hit my left leg and part of my uh, right foot. Oh, come on, I'll feel they're sleeping. And after some pretty dark days, Bosquez says he got himself back up. First walking, then running, now softball. And today, he's giving back. Every other weekend, I get to hang out with these guys and if I've gone through something, more than likely someone else has gone through the same thing. A safe haven where these kids can escape their troubles and just be kids. So it isn't like staring at me. Like when I'm out, everybody's like, what happened to your leg? Like, why do you have that here? They like understand. There is a lot of technique involved as well. Take the challenge of catching and then throwing when you have just one hand. And then I do this and then I get it out and then I hold on to it. As for why they do this, well, that's simple. For the same reason any kid picks up the glove. It feels like I'm normal and everybody's here has disabilities like me. It feels it feels like I'm in a pack. One, two, three, four. And that's what a team is all about. Love it so much. Now, the camp leads up to a big game tomorrow evening at the George Mason University. The Winter Warriors take on a celebrity team. I want to show you a picture of one of those celebrities. Check oh. it out. Larry Miller has played <laughs> yeah. in the tournament in the past, and he's back this year. Where did you guys find that picture? That is <laughs> awesome. He said, by the way, that's all. He said he got crushed last year. Yeah. yeah. yeah you look pretty good yeah. right there. Check I mean, I was, stance, I was, yeah, I was good faking it. I, I can fake things. And, <laughs> I mean, the ball was coming at me so fast. At one point, I just threw the bat. I was like, yeah, I, I'm, out. I'm out. Those kids are so good. They're really good. I yeah. mean, that girl's got an arm. I'd be watching out for her. Yeah, yeah strong, stronger than our arms, I think. Yeah, they were pretty <laughs> Absolutely. good. Absolutely. All right, thank you so much, Evan. Father's Day is this Sunday, and